Kampani ya pepe la mutakasi ya siti pawa iswe lidi zele tsolo la yona la hutima pepe la mutakasi tikulu hongi ya lineji ya hosen haka jeno. Te maina ya petue kwe bong tse fapa ni moho le matlong a tikulu hongi eo. Siti pawa ya bulela hai koloto wa chele dewa lwa hudiranta tse di milione tse mashuma mabedi tikulu hongi ya lineji ya fela. City Power is continuing with its revenue collection drive here in Lanasia. Currently we are at a building that is owing the entity over 1.2 million rand. They've just cut off, you know, the electricity to the building. This building is owing us uh, 4.5 million. So the reason why it's owing us 4.5 million today, we are coming here for the third time. So we're going to apply level three cutoff. So level one, we switch them off. So then they reconnect themselves. Level two, we switch them off and then they reconnect themselves. So that's why the, the bills keep on uh, accumulating. So today we are here to apply level three. Then they will have to pay 50% before we, we reconnect. The general manager of the Lanasia Service Delivery Center, you know, spoke to us to tell us that, you know, they are owing more than one billion rand and this was only the first project. They will still go to six other businesses and cut off their electricity. And they are also implying that they will not stop this cut-off operation because the city does not have money and such operations are a need. We we still have six to go. So the ones for today they are uh, they are owing us plus 20 billion, but in overall here in Indonesia, when we check our debt book, we are owed more than 1 billion. So today this uh, customer that we have identified, seven of them, so it's uh, plus uh, 20 million rent that uh, we are going to cut. It is going to get more intense because some customers are not wanting to comply. Some customers are retaliating when they bring their security services. But he says that they will not stop until they've collected each and every revenue that is supposed to be paid to the entity. For Soweto TV News, I am Zweli Banzi Mazibugo.